Welcome back. Hope everyone's been staying safe and having a great time today. I want to talk to you all about why I personally believe in PundiX and why I'm personally invested in their NPXS token. Plain and simple, really, as crypto adoption increases, so will the need to actually expand these crypto assets, cryptocurrencies, without having to transfer it several times before you can actually uh, utilize the funds. This is where the XPOS makes things so much easier because on top of that, it also accepts traditional payment methods. Now, definitely don't mistake this as something that's going to be simple to do because it's not going to be that simple. And it might actually take longer than you might have expected or might have thought in the back of your head. Now, more than likely, this sector of crypto will not be among the first ones to actually pop off and go. I believe that this requires more adoption and more time than say the money transfer sector or the store of value sectors. Now I won't lie to you, I don't know the specific numbers, but this is the way I see it. Imagine a scenario in where the XPOS is being utilized in over 65% of the retailers across the world. This means that the high demand or I apologize, the high supply of the NPXS token would actually make sense in this scenario. On top of that, they're constantly burning. So I think that kind of, uh, helps each other uh, as the years go on now don't get it wrong i don't invest or speculate in npxs because i think it's going to blow up within the next year i i don't do it for that reason because i can almost i won't say guarantee but i have a strong feeling that npxs is not going to be worth as much as you might want it to be within the next year i strongly believe that just as it's going to take more adoption to actually need the XPOS device, it's the same way with the actual price of the NPXS token. Because you got to think about it, I do personally believe that the XPOS system is ahead of its time because really think about it. At the moment, there's really no need for the XPOS device because crypto is not adopted at that level yet. But when crypto is adopted at a level that almost everybody has crypto and they want to spend it, then that's when the XPOS device pretty much would come in handy because then it would already be there. It would already be uh, a lot of them circulating around the world and a lot of them waiting to be shipped to whatever store may need it. So I think in a scenario like that, that's where the XPOS comes in. And that's kind of why I say I believe it's ahead of its time because it's not necessarily needed now, but it will be down the road when crypto reaches that level. Now, I do think that um, a lot of you like when I talk a little bit about the price because I know that many people actually ask about it. I tend to stay away from actually talking about it, but I'm just going to give you guys some pretty simple basic stuff right here. Um, Today, I believe we're a little bit up on the USD, not by much, but as you can see, it gets really interesting when you go to the seven day and the one month, you can see we're clearly moving up, not as much as we wanted to, but still, if if a bull run was to happen right now because of all of these different things, NPXS would not get left behind. It just, I just don't see that happening. Um, as you can see, if we move down to the month as well, it actually is going up. So we definitely have a trend there. We broke this point right here, and we also broke what we essentially started with in the month chart. So I think that things are looking very bright in the crypto uh, space right now. It definitely feels the same way it did on the actual... Uh, last uh, bull run that actually happened so i think it's definitely worth keeping an eye on all of this and again i'll say one last time before we end the video i personally think that npxs is a minimum five year hold period that's just my opinion let me know in the comments below if you think it's sooner later or whatever it may be one last thing actually if you guys want me to talk more about price charts and stuff like that for NPXS, then definitely leave it in the comments below and I'll put some stuff together and bring it out for you guys. But anyhow, that definitely does it for this video. Take care. You guys have a great day and see you all in the next one.